What's up guys, welcome back to a new YouTube video and today I will be attempting to make my first dress. Now, I never, like I said, I've never done this before. I don't even know what I'm doing. So if you're watching this video and you have made multiple dresses, you're a professional, leave me some tips in the comments below. Drop your Instagram, I'll follow you over there. So yeah, and yeah, I guess I'll start the process. Now, today I will be using this like, what is the Sherpa fabric? So I will be using this, not the most easiest fabric to work with. Um, yeah, I, I did a video on my Instagram, TikTok, and a shorts of me draping some glitter fabric on the mannequin that I showed you guys in the last video. Now I do have some official, official critiques, reviews, whatever you want to call it about this mannequin. This mannequin is lightweight which is not a good thing. It tips and turns and falls over every chance it gets. Um, it's just, it's too light. It's very light, but other than that, I guess it does what it do. I will give it a six and a half out of 10 as far as I know how a, a proper one should work. So, so yeah. But as far as this video, I will be trying to make a like a mini dress out of this fabric by just draping the fabric on here cutting everything so it like i said i do not have any experience with making dresses so yeah i do have zippers i don't even know if i'm gonna add a zipper because i just want this to be like a fun playful video and yeah i guess i'll get started now um i guess i'll try to do and this fabric is cut very very uneven, very just, I don't know why I cut this fabric like this. So this looks about, I guess, decent, if you want to say. Now, for the back, it looks like this. I was thinking it'd probably go like a low back, but... I'm talking like I know what I'm doing. I really don't. So, and when it comes to dresses, until I get more advanced in dresses and, and actually sewing dresses, don't listen to me. But this could be some tips for some anybody that wants to learn how to sew. A lot of people say sewing is easy, so we'll see how easy this. I'm literally, I'm literally only going to try to cut like two panels, a front panel and a back panel, and just hope for the best. So this is what the back is looking like as far as I just pinned it up with a, a little clip. Now, will this be sleeveless and strapless? Yes, because I don't know what else to do. As far as like mini, it's very mini because it's, I don't even know what, you, you probably can do like an over, you could probably wear this over something. So yeah, you probably can wear this over something. So now I'm gonna look at it, hold on, make sure everything looks right. This looks uneven. So, let me see, how does that look? How does that, I'm probably gonna do like a raw, a raw hem at the bottom, cause I don't, like I said, I want this to be as simple as possible. Let me actually look at this. Okay. You know what? I probably actually end up doing a. a, a, a um, the back looks nice as far as like. It looked like it actually could be something. I'm just draping it, see how it falls, and pretty much going from there. I'm cutting more off than I need to because, no, I'm cutting off less than I need to because I don't know how this is going to look. So I'm pretty much just trying to get a, a rough shape. I want this to be like a tight, 
tight dress too, like a form-fitting dress, because this fabric, hold on, this fabric, hold on, is actually very, very, very stretchy, like very stretchy. Whew, that just took a lot. How do we look? Very, very unequal. So let me see. It got some nice movement to it. Hold on, let me stop. The one thing that's good about this mannequin is like fabric actually sticks to it. Like you can just put that on there and it ain't going nowhere. So that's a good thing. Now as far as this goes, let me see, let me see, let me see. Like I said, I want it to be a little more tight. So I want to bring in the sides. I don't even know. I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. But hopefully something comes out of this. That's the best I'm gonna get. Um, I could, you know, mess with this some more, but. That's gonna make it shorter than it needs to be. It looks a little stiff. That's because it's sticking to the mannequin. So, and here's how the back looks. The back, it looks like something. I will give it that. I like that nice pleated look, you know. I'm trying to make it seem like I know what I'm talking about, but I really don't. But I know what pleats are. So yeah, the back, very nice. How I'm gonna do this, I don't know. I don't know if I wanna just, you know, go like that. Actually, that worked out pretty good. And go like that, hold on. Cut that, and then do something with the back. What, I don't know. I could just sew it up like this. This is now this is the hard part because it's like okay at this stage what do I do? What do I do at this stage? Because I could just cut this straight up, boom, and that's the front part, and then cut this straight down, boom. That's the, that's the front part too. So it's like one panel, and then I sew one panel front, one panel back, and then we good. But um, I want to keep this look. I'm surprised this mannequin ain't fall over yet. But yeah, I want to keep this look. Actually, let me see. So if I sew this way, how is that going to look? How is that going to look? I want to take that off. Wait a minute, guys. This is my first dress, and I don't even know what I'm doing. I don't know what I'm doing. But I got an idea of shape. I got something that I can work with. I'm just trying to see, should I just boom, and then boom. Now, the back will not stay the same. I'm 100% sure of that because actually, okay, I think I know what I can do now. Like I said, I want this to be a simple dress. So a little slip on dress, if you will. So I will just actually cut straight up. cut off that excess fabric. Don't know if I made a bad decision or a good decision, but nevertheless, a decision was made. 
And what if I just sew so just like that, roll, or keep that? I don't know at this point. But you know what? Something has to be done. Because if I do that, so how am I? It's very hot in here. It's really hot. I'm scared. This fabric is not is not cheap while I'm talking. That's why I'm nervous, because this fabric was not cheap. This fabric was like, I think $20 a yard. $15, $20 a yard. So this was expensive. Now I didn't buy this for this project. I bought this for some crew necks that have already sold out, but I had extra fabric that I couldn't do nothing with, so I'm sorry guys. I'm very nervous. If I just do that, oh, but why would I do that in two panels? When I could just, like I said, do this in one thing. Now I'm cutting off extra fabric. The more I cut, the more nervous I get. This has to stay like that. So I'm gonna pin this. I'm gonna pin this just like this. Cause I can't cut off no more fabric. I can, but I'm choosing not to. Okay, that's that part. I don't think I'm gonna be able to keep the little ruffle in the back, the little pleated look in the back, so. Once I learn some more, this should be easier. So, okay, after multiple trims, after multiple panic attacks, this is what I have. The back is a straight back, I guess, that's if that's what you want to call it. It looks very stiff. These parts look very stiff because they're stuck to this mannequin, but I promise you it, it'll be more, you know, and this is how the front looks. Not what I wanted to go for, but for a first dress, for a first whatever this is, um, it'll have to work. Now I'm going to try to sew this together. How? I don't quite know yet. So, actually, now I could probably do the here and then do. I could probably do that now. Since the what would be the fun? That's what I'm saying. If anybody knows how to sew a dress, anybody sew professional at this please just watch your channel so I can watch your videos but this is gonna be a good look back to when I start making Matt Gala dresses so this is just the start now I'm gonna unpin everything and pray and hope for the best because I don't know I don't know what's about to happen. So yeah. So I just unpinned this. Wish me luck. Okay, so I have it clipped down as best of my ability as I can do right now. Um, and now, we mess up some fabric. Okay. So now let's take it back to the form and let's put it on. Which one is the pin? I should have cut off the excess fabric. But yeah, that's dirty. Right there. I feel like I'm gonna have to make it more tighter. That's why you should install a zipper, because this will make it so much easier. 
Yeah, man. Okay. I need to ring this part of here. I need to ring this part here. That's going to cut so short. Okay, guys. You know what? It has it has to do something. You know, I don't know if this is. It has to do something. I don't know if this is a fail or a major success. Major success because I made a dress with one seam. Is it the prettiest dress? No. Here's the back. I'm gonna give you guys a better look. Here's the back. Here's the front. I did what I could do. That's all I'm going to say. I did what I could do for somebody that don't know nothing about dresses. I made one with one seam. One seam dress. <sighs> Let me see. Because it, it can't. If I take in the sides, I'm going to keep it like this. I could bring it in. Make it more trueistic, realistic to the um to the sewing mannequin, but I'm 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 not gonna do that. I hate how this camera is just so cropped in. I gotta stand all the way back for y'all to see me. But I'm gonna wrap up this video. Thank you guys again for watching. If you wanna see more videos like this, subscribe to the channel. And yeah, if you tell me how you really feel about this dress. You, you can be mean, you can be nice, you can be whatever you, just, I want honest, honest, honest opinions. Follow me, subscribe to YouTube, Instagram, all that stuff, it'll be linked in the description. But see you guys in the next video. Peace.